All right, pinball fans, I'm going to go over uh, what are the best files to back up for your uh, virtual pinball drive. Uh, mainly, you want to back up everything. You want to back up your whole V pinball folder. Okay? And then, of course, if you got PROC, uh, you want to back that folder up. Uh, DOF, whatever, whatever you have on their C drive. Um, then inside, you got your future pinball your pinup system, and visual pinball. 80% of the files that you need to back up are going to be in visual pinball. Uh, and most of them are in the vpin main folder. So let's go to visual pinball, vpin main. You want your alt colors, of course. You can drag, drag that whole folder back in. Alt sound, you can drag that back in. Config, the config is all of your ROM settings. So if you have say external DMD turned off on something or if you have alt sound turned on on something this is where all that's saved there's no um, you don't need Windows registries backed up or anything like that all that stuff saved right here so you can uh, save your configs then of course you need your NVRAMs all those are the ROM settings themselves um, and some tables need those special ones to run you know, you might have a download to come with it. I know a lot of, a lot of uh, Gottlob tables and stuff like that. So make sure you have all your uh, NVRAM. That's where your high scores and all that are saved. They're, they're in here. Okay. Um, then, of course, the ROMs themselves. That's part of the hardest thing to gather over, the, over time. So make sure you download. Keep all those. Then, you want your DMD device to INI. That's where all the locations are for your DMD, and especially now with uh, Pinball FX and Pinball M, if you have external DMD running on them, all those are in here, so you don't want to lose that. Um, and then the only other file I would suggest would be your VP alias. So if you're running a lot of alt, like grease and all that, make sure you back that up. That way you don't have to do that again. Okay. So, that's VP alias, DMD device to INI, your ROMs, NVRAM, config, alt sound, alt color. Alright, and if you back up, you want to get your tables, you want to grab all those. Make sure you get the Ultra DMDs, the back glasses, and the tables. Every time I redo my whole system, I end up downsizing. I think originally I had like thousand some tables, and uh, I went down to maybe 700 and 500 and 300. I think now I'm down to like I don't even know. Let's see. I just backed up my system, so 289. VPX tables. That's all I have now. So, like I said, uh, you, if you have INIs and POVs, you could use those. Just make sure you can't have both. Um, if it's a 10.8 or you're running in 10.8, make sure you, you can get the INIs. That way to save your POV and settings and all that. Only use the old POV if you're going to keep those in 10.7. Uh, the INI is 10.8, sorry. But I only keep a few old POVs that I'm not going to run in 10.8. Uh, Alright, so that's our tables folder. Make sure you get your music folder because a lot of original tables have music. And if it's missing when you go to play it, then of course you, you know, you'll have an error. You'll be missing a file. Blood machines, I'll make sure you got those. But anyway, make sure you keep your music. That's pretty much it out of here. If you go to pinup system, I already showed you about backing up your um, pupdatabase.db. That's where all your information is stored. And then, of course, you want to get your pop media folder. You can save all of that. 
and your putt videos because that's where your putt packs are. Okay. So putt media, all your media, putt videos, all your uh, putt packs. All right. And then, like I said, then you got future pinball. You want to um, save your DMD device to INI &I that you have for future pinball because that has your um, colors for your DMD and your locations for the DMD. I don't have very many games, but that's where that's stored. And of course, you got your tables. I don't have very many, but the ones I do have, I like to keep. Um, you want to back up your libraries. This is where the extra files come from on some tables. So make sure you have all your libraries. Um, and then you want to go into BAM and you want to back up your configs. All right, these are all your table configs. That way, and that's about it. Like I said, make sure you, if you want to P Rock, you save that folder. Um, you should. That's usually in a straight C drive, so you don't have to really have to mess with P Rock. You can just leave it, leave it installed. Um, the only thing that's not in this folder are, are the tables and they'll be in your tables folder so alright hope that helps you guys out if you have any questions hit me up and until next time